Hello everyone, Epiclipse here, and in today's video we're going to be doing yet another crate opening, and this one's going to be for the brand new update with bring Season 6 and a whole bunch of other new features. So this is going to be opening the Exilic crates that just came out, so first we'll uh, look at them as I just want to say something really quickly, that um, tomorrow or later on tonight uh, there's going to be another video coming out, and I just want to mention it because it's a, a little bit of a surprise because I haven't done videos on this in a while, but rocket Mo rocket league mods is back they've been working on making a updated rocket launcher for doing a whole bunch of modding and stuff so a lot more fun playlists and stuff like that and let me tell you guys this this new rocket launcher that they're releasing is 10 times better than the past one and you guys are gonna love it it's it's great so you guys just keep checking in and keep posting into the rocket league mods reddit and stuff like that and see when it gets posted because it's going to be great and also as per usual i will have a video out on it before pretty much anyone i should i might have it out before even the rocket launcher comes out so come check out that video and that will be about the uh, mod and basically how to use it in all of its features and stuff like that so i'm very very excited about that and very excited to be able to make more mod uh, orientating videos and plus LAN is back as well obviously it's there now but we uh obviously we figured out a way to well they figured out a way to connect to each other so that's super exciting but uh let's get into the crates all right so first of all we'll just look through all the stuff in here so the first thing is pearlescent matte and this is basically just a paint that is what it is to be said pearlescent that's just matte and then we have a mantis uh skin here and it is Mantis Critters, and uh, I think it looks pretty cool. It's a little bit of an interesting looking skin. Uh, I don't know how exactly I feel about it. And then we have Dominus GT Splattered, and uh, I actually like this skin a lot, and I'm really excited to see it. Um, I like this decal a lot, and I'm excited to see it painted. Uh, and then Breakout Chainsaw, which is a pretty decent skin. It's a little bit more random and stuff. And then Sentio V17, uh, however you say it. But that is this, and... Uh, Pretty cool. It's a another interesting one, and it's also for the Siento. Uh, and then we have two trails. We have the Lightning Trail, which is pretty cool, um, and we have Hot Rocks Trail, which is uh, also a little bit interesting, a little different. And then for wheels, we have the wheels Gadent. How to say these? I'm not even gonna try to. But I think these look pretty cool. They look kind of like sports car wheels in a way. Um, so those are pretty cool. And then we have this snake skin. We have the Jager Six. RS skin, which is pretty cool, which also brings us to the new car, which is the Jaeger 690 RS. Um, so that is also awesome. And we have a new boost power shot. It's it, to me, it looks pretty standard to all the other ones. So I'm excited to see what it looks like painted though. So that should be interesting. And we have these wheels that also look kind of awesome. And uh, this, if this is painted, it's gonna be awesome because you see how there's all these different colors going on so i'm really curious to see what these are painted and then for the paint for the exotic wheels this time i think they did an awesome job on it these wheels look awesome and painted with a kind of two-tone color going on that's gonna look great so hopefully we can get some painted one of these and we can see what they look like ourselves and then we have clockwork which i think might be my new favorite wheels because these are <laughs> i don't know for, for some reason i find them awesome i believe they're a minute clock by the way it's going because that's about a second that goes and then uh not yeah that's about one second i i honestly have no idea how the clocks work i'm sure they put it out somewhere but that's what it seems like to me um but those are pretty awesome and then we have two new goal explosions popcorn and party time both pretty awesome and then we have fireworks and hellfire both in this crate as well so we have 20 of these crates let's open the first one right now hopefully we can start off with something great uh, also i'm really surprised how quickly we were able to get these well i was able to get these crates it was literally within 20 minutes of it being out okay as per usual we're going to start out with the painted the paint uh the pearlescent matte paint um looks very plain on my car but it's cool i like how they added new paint to the game so um adds a little variety in there and then into our second crate now. Um, hopefully we can get you know some decent items through these 20 crates. Here's some Gadent wheels. Um, I can't tell, they look just unpainted, so we'll have to see. Yep, just normal Gadent wheels. 
Okay, third crate a charm. I don't think that's ever been a saying before, but it can be now if we get something good. That would have been something good if we could have got that. Nope, we got a I believe that's what it says. I just chose not to say it before. Um, okay, we're into the fourth crate now. Nothing really too interesting yet. Yeah, we got the new wheels, but um, we're hoping for something painted, you know. Okay, well, we got the chrono wheels, but um, they look normal, but I'm very excited about getting them. Oh, they're certified. All right. All right. Not bad at all. Not bad. I'm just happy to have these wheels because honestly, they look awesome. And I'm really curious to see if they look really good with my alpha loadout that is on the other team. So I might be rocking these wheels. Who knows? But um, on to the next crate and let's see what we get oh yeah there we go we got the jager okay oh i'm really happy that we got this oh yeah i'm excited to see this uh use this car it looks pretty nice i mean it looks pretty much like a porsche to me but you guys can tell me if it looks like something else to you i think it looks like a porsche but um all right into the next crate let's see what we're gonna get here Oh, so close to fireworks, but we got ourselves some craters going on here. Um, yeah. Again, you know, nothing too special there, so I didn't really show you guys. I mean, you guys got to see through the list, so let's hopefully we can get something special. Something good out of the new crate. I mean, we already got those exotic wheels, so nonetheless, I'm pretty happy with that. And now we got the snake skin for the Jager as well. Okay. Off to, uh... I'd say a pretty pretty good start. Import exotic. Can't get much better than that. To be honest, guys, I'm really hoping for those clockwork wheels. Especially if we can get them painted pink. I would love it. Oh, <laughs> if we could have got another pair of chrono wheels, that would have been crazy. But instead, we've got some breakout chainsaw going on here. Alright, so we got 12 more crates left. This is our ninth crate we're opening, I'm pretty sure. Sense. Um, no, that doesn't make sense. I believe this is our eighth crate opening, but in our eighth crate, we're gonna get uh, Dominus GT Splatter. Hopefully, we can get this painted because I think it looks sick painted. No, we just got it normal, unfortunately. Okay, let's keep on going. We're bound to get something great. Bound 20 crates, I feel like, is the number that you're bound to get something really good. Oh. Ooh. Oh, in between the two, how mean. I really thought we were about to get party time. I was going to get so hyped up about that. Look at the picture for Clockwork. Have you guys seen that? I don't know if you have. I've noticed it a couple times. The picture looks pretty awesome to me. But let's see what we get in this one. Ooh, only if we could have got that. Also, I'm really interested to see if the uh, trails this time could be painted. Cause remember, obviously, the last crate they couldn't be. So hopefully in this crate they can be. Um, but on to the next crate. Come on, give us something good here. Come on. Alright, Hot Rocks. I want to see if he could be painted. It doesn't look like it's painted, but who knows. Nope, just normal. Doesn't mean that it can't be painted, but that was just a normal one. Um, okay. To the next crate. Come on. Something good. Okay, all right, we'll take it. Take the new wheels. I can't ever tell if these are painted or not either, but they look normal. Yeah, they are, but those look pretty sick. So I'm excited to get the new exotic wheels there. Uh, new um, import wheels, I mean. We've gotten a pretty good variety of things here, you know. But, but uh, we, you know, we've almost, we're getting there. We could get every single item in the crate. Um, I believe so. I think we only need two more things. The other exotic wheel and, um, boost. So that's pretty... Oh, no, and then we need the other trail as well. But I think we can get that. Stop getting rare decals at some point. <laughs> um. Okay. So we have five more crates left. Let's hope out of these five more we could pull something out. 
It's really great. I'd love to get painted wheels this early on. Come on. Give me some painted wheels. Okay, or another hot rocks. Guess that's just as good. Uh, this is a certified hot rocks. Not what we're looking for. I would have taken a painted one because then we get to see if it get painted or not. But uh, okay, we're dialing down here. Last couple crates. Okay, we got one of the items we haven't gotten yet. Lightning. That's good. Maybe we can get lightning painted. Although I'd assume that it would show. Did get it. Also, if you know if you can't get it painted or if you can get it painted, let me know in the description. Description. I don't know why I always say that in the comments. But, uh. Okay, we got some Gaiden wheels. Uh, I believe they, they look normal again. I can't really tell. If, unless they're just like a pretty bland color because they look pretty dark normally. So, can't tell if they're gray or black painted. Bionics likes to do that. But, um. Onto our final two crates. Um, I feel like we did pretty good nonetheless. I uh, was really hoping for some painted wheels or maybe even the universal, but here we're getting another Jaeger uh, snakeskin going on. I'm just really happy that we managed to get the Jaeger in general because it... so this is the last accelerator crate we have right now. So, get something good. If not, I mean, there's going to be another crate opening with obviously a lot more crates, and then there'll be a big trade up video. That's how we usually do it here. So hopefully we can get something good to end off on here. Come on. Oh, I would have much rather the boots, but maybe if we can get this painted, make up for it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, they kind of match. They're close. I think I like the lightnings more, but they were close. All right. Well, that was the 20 crate opening that we had. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed how quick we were able to get this out because I really try to push and get it as quick as I possibly could. But uh, besides from that, um, I think we did pretty good. We got pretty solid items there, and you guys got to see some of the items up close and the new car. I'm also very, very excited to try out that new car. But as I said before, uh, the Rocket League mod video should be coming out soon, along with the new version of Rocket Launcher. So stay tuned for that and uh, more crate opening videos, trade up videos. And I'm going to try to post a lot more videos in general now. I was just waiting for this update to really just start everything off. So there should be a start of a... Uh, hopefully a new path for the channel. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. This has been Epic Clips and I'll see you guys in the next one.